Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and we are going to talk about, of course, version 1909 of Windows 10 because this is what is now running on my main computer and has been running for 48 hours. So what's the verdict? Do I like it? Do I have problems? Anything special happening? Well, um, if we look at the install itself, it went flawlessly. It um, took maybe 20, 25 minutes as a cumulative update. So, you know, no big reinstall of Windows or anything, which is, of course, a much welcome change to the past big feature updates. Uh, if you want to know what's new, well, I talked about the very few little things that are new in here, which is also a welcome thing because I think most of what the features most of the features actually that you know, Microsoft has added to Windows in the past um, you know few versions honestly I don't think there's a lot of people that actually use them and maybe focusing more on the quality of the of, of Windows rather than anything else is probably the best thing that they could do so I've been running it for 48 hours uh, in that 48 hours, it probably ran like 25 hours out of 48 because my PC is like always running. I'm always doing something. I've uh, played games. I've uh, done some uh, different, uh, done different things with uh, you know Office and different software, even this uh, recording software, doing videos. Also, um, a live show. I did a one live show, which uh, was going through with streaming and everything. All I can say, there's nothing wrong everything works great uh, it's interesting because it seems that um, maybe there's already drivers available because immediately my laptop after upgrade my um, Nvidia uh, card said well you know what? there's a driver update for graphics which I applied and of course uh, made sure that it uh, was okay and everything just works great so um, you know it seems to be a stable operating system we uh, of course just want to make sure that Microsoft does not do another, um, you know, turn 1909 into another uh, big joke like 1903, where 1903's, um, you know, deployment went really, really well. And then cumulative updates after cumulative updates of all sorts of little problems here and there that is just a big joke. So, um, and by the way, there's a new cumulative update for bug fixes yesterday on 1903. If you are over there, almost half of you are now there. Once again, if you are wondering, wow, well, I'm, I'm on 1903, how come I don't see 1909? No, you don't see it. It's not available yet to you guys that are not insiders. This is an insider thing right now. It's still not released. It's very close to being released. I suspect that next week's um, event, Microsoft event, on October 2nd, we might actually have a name and a release date and we might have details about this because uh, we'll be in October version is 1909 and uh, that's September so it's kind of interesting because there's still a few days left uh, will they release this on the last day of September uh, or something like that I don't know it seems it is feature complete for those I wonder so that's why I already installed it because it's totally feature complete there's nothing you're gonna add to this 1909 and uh, the only thing that they will maybe do is release another release preview but um, this works great I've got really no flaws no blue screens no freezes uh, this is running on a um, Acer Nitro 5 gaming laptop I'm also running one version on my HP an old HP Core 2 desktop that also is running quite well with this uh, version of uh, Windows 10 so um, you know I think that it looks like a good upgrade and um, hopefully it will fix some of the flaws that 1903 had after the cumulative updates arrived so a uh, good experience up until now and uh, let's cross our fingers that that's what it's all gonna be about as it starts rolling out in about a month from now not even a month maybe in just a few weeks if you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.